And to environmental matters, the torrential rainfall across most part of Lagos in the last few days has left many res Lagos residents in fear as houses and properties have been destroyed by the flood waters. It would be recalled that the Lagos State Government has earlier warned residents of the impending downpour with attendant socio-economic implications for residents of the state. Our correspondents brought in this report. It's been a Thierry Ido Cabello celebration as the heavy downpour experienced across the Lagos metropolis with the attendant flood left many with salt taste in their mouth. Though the Lagos state government had earlier alerted residents on the possibility of a heavy rains in the days ahead, not much was done by either government to desilt the canals or the residents to keep the drains clean. From command to Okweki in the Paja Axis, a suburb of the state, it was tales of frustration and anxiety as the rains that began in the early hours of Friday continued to Saturday. Earlier Saturday, four people were said to have been rescued from a car that was swept away in the flood around Fatoki area of Orile Agege. According to Ibrahim Fariloye, Southwest Zona Coordinator of the National Emergency Management Agency, NEMA, seven people were reported to have been swept away when rainwater overflowed an uncompleted canal in the area. <laughs> Beyond sounding the flood alarm bells, government may need to be more proactive to avoid any human disaster and also put measures in place to check made flooding. Funke Adesoji, reporting for Civil Bears News 24. The persistent rainfall in the last few days has led to many parts of Lagos State being flooded. Seawater. The flooded drainages on streets and canals have disrupted activities and in some instances, the flood's path have led to the loss of several valuables, leaving residents to devise alternative means to commute to their various destinations. The streets of Yaba appear to be one of the worst hit, with vehicles including emergency responders stranded. Some have taken to the flood, going for a swim in the deep colored water. <laughs> but while it may be fun for some, it is a matter of life and death for others. A white vehicle with occupants inside is spotted being washed away in Agege. The vehicle is eventually spotted a few streets away as volunteers make efforts to rescue those trapped inside. <laughs> Two residents were said to be spotted struggling for their lives with the waves of the streams in another part of Lagos. <laughs> For the floods not season, one resident is heard calling out the state's special advisor to the governor on drainages, Joey Gokwe, to swing into action. We are Joey Gokwe.